In this video, we'll determine the molecular geometry for CBr4, carbon tetrabromide. The first thing we need to do is look at the Lewis structure. So here's our Lewis structure, and sometimes you'll see lines here instead of the two electrons, but this represents the bond between the carbon and the bromine atom. So we have electrons shared between these two atoms. When we look at the Lewis structure, it's flat. We really need to think about this in three dimensions. So let's do that. So let's consider this our central carbon atom, and we'll add four of the bromine atoms. One, two, and you see they spread out to be as far away from each other as they can. Another one spreading out still, and then the last one. And what we end up with is this tetrahedral molecular geometry. If we look at the bond angles for this, we'd see they're 109.5. And you can see any way you move this, you're going to end up with that tetrahedral geometry. The electron geometry, that's also going to be tetrahedral. Let's go back to our Lewis structure, and we can see we have our central carbon with four things, four different things bonded to it. So let's take a look at this table here. So when we have four things bonded to that central atom, we end up with tetrahedral. We don't have any lone pairs, so zero lone pairs and four things bonded to that central atom there. That is a tetrahedral molecular geometry. If you were going to write the AXN notation, you could look at it this way. You could say your central atom, the carbon, that would be A, each of these would be X, and there's no lone pair, so we don't have anything for N. We would say it's A, X, one, two, three, four, AX, four. Sometimes you'll see N, zero. Either way, we have AX, four, which is tetrahedral. So both the table and then this notation here, the AXN notation, end up with the same thing. Again, the bond angles, 109.5, and the molecular geometry is the same as the electron geometry. This is Dr. B with the This is Dr. B with the molecular geometry for CBr4, carbon tetrabromide. Thanks for watching.